In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a morph transition effect in PowerPoint and this is how the slide looks. As you can see here, I have added this background image and I have put the text which is desert and you can add some detailed text here. And when I click, it goes to the next one which is the jungle and you can see the, uh, the background color also changes according to the image. And then the third one comes the river and the mountains. Please share, like and subscribe my channel and the only channel on YouTube for PowerPoint where you can get 1000 plus free templates absolutely free and I have provided the link on the video description section of each video and you can support my channel through PayPal or Patreon. So let's start the tutorial. Add a new slide, go to the view tab, enable the guides, then go to the insert shapes, select the rectangle, draw the rectangle covering half of the slide only. You can see here till this grid line and shape outline make it no outline then right mouse click go to the format shape here I'm going to insert any picture of my choice so I can just go and simply click on the picture or texture fill so this is the last time I've used this picture that's the reason it is showing this picture here and then what you can do is you have to duplicate this image three more times so let me just zoom out a little bit then hold the control shift key add it toward the right side of the slide and give a different picture here to give a different picture you can go to the insert either if you have a picture from your local pc you can choose these options or you can just go and choose any online pictures and select the picture here all right so in this case i'm just going to show you here i have similar way i've added four different pictures here you can see here there's two three and four pictures so two are on the slide area and the other two are outside of the slide area okay let me just undo this one so i'm going to use this particular slide only all right so one more thing which i want to do is let me just select all these four options you can go to the uh, effects and then you can just go and make it somewhat transparent you can see here so we exactly know where our slide is okay so let me just put it maybe 25 or 30 percent then go to the insert shapes select the rectangle draw a rectangle covering the full all the pictures here okay something like this shape outline make it no outline and this also i'm going to make somewhat transparent all right so now the next thing which i'm to do is i would like to show only this picture in a kind of a frame or something like that for that go to insert shapes select one rounded corner rectangle and i'm going to draw a rounded corner rectangle maybe this much size you can see here then i'm going to cut this one all right first of all make it no outline so i'm going to select this shape the biggest the big rectangle then hold the shift key select the small one then go to the shape format merge shape and click on subtract so we end up getting a you can see here the background image is visible all right so now for this what i'm going to do is i'm going to insert some text here okay so to go to insert text box here i'm going to say desert all right so let me just make it a uh, normal size the font color i'm going to use as white and i'm going to use open sans extra bold increase the size all right something like this and here also this image also we have made it less transparent we can make it zero transparent here okay and then the background color which i'm going to use is of a like of a sand okay for that let me just go to the shape format shape fill and I'm going to use the eyedropper and I'm going to give any dark color here. All right, you can see here, it looks kind of this and then go to the insert text box. I'm going to insert equals L-O-R-E-M within brackets one, some detailed text which you can edit it later, okay? So this is my very first slide, all right? So you can see here, let me just zoom out. So this is my very first slide. So now I'm going to duplicate this. So right mouse click and click on duplicate okay so now i'm going to move this information and this text to the other image all right so for that what i can do is i can just select this one and i'm going to move away my you can see here focus towards this which is kind of a jungle 
yeah so for this also go to the fill and remove the transparent effect all right so now let me just show you how it looks the first one it looks like this the second one looks like this and but you can see here the text is getting cut so what we need to do is select the text and bring towards the this side left side okay and make sure this is align right and shape format align right all right so now instead of desert i'm going to bring it somewhat down and i'm going to make this as a say jungle all right and the color i'm going to choose a different color which is the color i'm going to use which matches the jungle here so this is my second slide all right now duplicate the slide one more time go to the third slide now again third slide i'm going to select the text and this one and i'm going to bring it somewhat down remember that these two images already we have finished so what i'm going to do is i'm going to select these images and i'm going to bring this in the middle here you can see here something like this and then let me just these two images also i'm going to make it uh, transparency effect to zero and then select this one and bring it to the original position so you can see here now my uh, focus will be on the jungle oh, sorry this river all right so i'm going to make this as a river and then the color i'm going to choose which could be somewhat blue or dark blue this color all right so now the last one duplicate one more time again i'm going to select this 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 and moving towards the you can see here this side okay which is the mountains and now bring this here all right and make sure it is aligned left and here also aligned left and i'm going to say these are mountains if you want you can just reduce the text all right and then this one so using the eyedropper i'm going to give a kind of this color all right so now let me just go back to the first slide so you see here this is my desert jungle river and mountain now the magic comes when we apply the morph transition so here except the first slide okay uh, leave don't select the first slide second uh, select the second third and fourth slide go to the transitions click on the morph all right and here morph effect options sorry here you go to the duration duration you make it only 0.75 so let me just play now so this is the desert, the jungle, river, and mountain. So you can just play back once, once more. You can see here, this is how it looks.